Let's learn how to use the new background replace feature in Kittle right now. All right, as you can see, we have a design here. And if I go to textures, we have a new area right here called backgrounds. If I click on that, now you can see a variety of backgrounds where if I click on this, it will immediately apply to the background. So easy to do. We have so many different options for you to use backgrounds that are already there. Now, if I want something different, I can easily just go back in here and click it and it will switch the image to the image that I have selected instead of the previous one. Now, you can see it here in background as well and you can still change the brightness and contrast just like you can any other image so you still have all of your adjustments. I can also right click and release the background and move it around, I can make it bigger or I could just get rid of it. Now, another thing you can do is go over and choose a photo from our photos tab to become the background. And I'm gonna show you how to do that. So let's go ahead and find a sunset that is gonna work. I think this one is nice. It's got some similar colors there. Now, instead of going to the layers and trying to drag it all the way down to the bottom like that, and then having to expand it like this and then go over and lock it, which is one method you could do. Let's go back and do this all again. But instead, I'm just gonna select my image and without using the layers, I'm gonna add this, make it really big. And then I can simply right click and go use as background. And when I do that, boom, it immediately applies to the background. If I go back to layers, you can see here, boom, it's the background. And then I can select it and continue to use my adjustments or whatever else I want to do with the background as an image easily. Now, if you want to see other tutorials using Kittle, I have these videos here on my right that I know you're going to enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any upcoming videos and features and things like that. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next video.